guys welcome back so today's video is gonna be something a little bit different like five years ago ish there was like this trend of like freshman versus senior or like freshman in high school versus freshman in college type videos and that's what this video is because I'm doing my freshman year of high school makeup versus my makeup now which if you don't know I am in college, I couldn't tell you if I'm technically a freshman or a sophomore based off of credits, but if we're going based off of years, I am my first year of college, but I'm also three semesters in, like this is my third semester, so like, whatever. But I'm 18, so for the purpose of this video, I'm a freshman, okay? Okay. <laughs> but my makeup while it has drastically changed in some ways hasn't in others what i mean by that is i pretty much still just don't wear makeup <laughs> i've never really been a big fan of wearing makeup 24 7. i like to do it and i think i'm decent at it when i want to be but most of the time i don't actually put makeup on but i'm gonna like wipe off my face make sure that like I don't have anything on because I did wear makeup on Monday and like you know sometimes makeup just doesn't like to come off but I'd say I'm good I just see like a little bit of mascara but I wouldn't say anything else came off but now I gotta let my face dry but that's fine because that lets me talk a bit so I swore by this lived by this this was my Go to shit. I don't even know if they sell this anymore. This is literally one that I had when I stopped using it because <laughs> you can still see some of the words in it. But yes, it's this little elf palette that um, if I open it up, I don't know if you can tell, they are all shimmer shades, especially these three, and these are the three that I used. So That doesn't tell you what my makeup was looking like. I don't know what else will, but this is what I used on my eyes every single day, religiously. And mascara, I honestly still kind of use the same mascara-ish. I was in love with Better Than Sex mascara, which I still use from occasion. Like I literally have tubes of this shit lying around right now. I showed you the two big ones, and I have two mini ones, and then I have the waterproof. Like, when I tell you I have this shit on deck, but like, I don't even think there's mascara in this tube. I just still have it. And then this tube should still be fine. Yeah, there's still stuff on that one. But like, this tube I should have thrown out forever ago and just like, haven't because I'm a lazy piece of shit you know but I have these other mascaras too that I used to like go back and forth with so it's like this one I don't really know the name of it um, by Maybelline and then this one um, but these were like my super there's dust all over them these were like my super if I'm doing something like type of a look and also to preface I'm gonna have like freshmen freshmen like on each side so you can directly compare them and then I'm gonna take it off and regret my life decision <laughs> what else would I do um for concealer and stuff I honestly used to like not wear any um, since then we have grown some nice eye bags but 13 year old me did not have those um I bet you I did I just didn't do anything for them but this I have been using since freshman year it's just a face primer which I think it's funny that I put primer on my face but I didn't put anything else on my face like I had this little L'Oreal and I only use this shade as highlighter. And these three products, 
oh, I lied, these four products plus like an eyelash curler is all that I would do freshman year. So this is my freshman year side, which will be this side. And I'm going to just do her first. So, um, yeah, I'm gonna do that now. So for this, I used to put this on my little hand. That was bougie. It looks like that. I still use this stuff on occasion if my face is like really dry, but it feels like super oily when you first put it on. And then it slowly goes in and doesn't feel oily. And like my face feels fine. I'm gonna like wipe my fingers off though. Although I'm curious to see like I don't know, I guess this side's softer. Like, I don't really know what this primer does. I don't know if it's, like, helpful. But technically, I still use it today. But, you know, we're not on today yet. So, we got that. Now, I just used my finger. Didn't use a brush for everything, just so you know. Look at her. She pigmented. I went like that. Rubbed her in. Put a little on the nose, because I did know to do that. And um, that's all I would do for her. Okay, now I gotta let my finger dry for a minute here. So now, this. Literally, I kid you not, I would go like this, get it on my finger, go like this, put it all over my eyelid, and I would go back with this one. I would put it and then I would grab her I would put her like here and then if I felt like it I would grab a clean finger go back with the lighter one and put her right there that's it I don't know if you can really I'll do a nice like close-up of like the difference when I'm done but that is all I did for eyeshadow oh and then mascara just quickly gonna do that okay so I'm back my eyes like physically hurting from this because I used to put a ton of mascara on like this is like me just sitting there going like this for like a hot second but yeah, so I mean, bare face to what I wore to school, really not all that different from what I looked like originally. You know, not too much of a difference. I was also 13, as I said, so I'm like just figuring out makeup. So now, for the makeup I do now, let me just get my stuff together and we'll cut to me doing it. Okay, so. For makeup that I would wear to school, like, I'm gonna go just off of senior year because that's the last time that I went to school, you know? But what I would typically wear is nothing. But for the sake of this video, if I did wear makeup to school, this is what I would normally do. I would obviously style my brows, which ignore them right now because they're in desperate need of me fixing them. They, they do not look cute right now. Um, I would also probably put her on, but not nearly as much as I put on the other side of my face, and mainly just like rub it like that. And there you go. Like, that's not healthy, hygienic at all, but that's what I would do. So, you know. Okay, I have a couple different things that I would do. I have this Revlon concealer that's like almost out I don't know if you can tell like it's kind of been through some stuff with me like she's kind of old yeah that's disgusting there's a hair <laughs> ew okay that's disgusting. If that doesn't tell you how long it's been since I've used this Revlon concealer, I don't know what will because that was more of a like 
junior year concealer and I stopped wearing her a while ago. But I also got into this thing called color correctors. Here, they're a thing. And I have a specific beauty blender for them. I'm trying to figure out what, oh, this one has, I think it's this one. Whatever, I'm gonna use this one. A little beauty blender, didn't get it wet. I usually don't use beauty blenders, so um, I would, I'm trying to see. I felt like maybe the green like a little bit like there, where like my nose is kind of red, because green counteracts red and red, well this color is supposed to counteract this down here. And probably like that. I've never gone like overboard with makeup. Then a little beauty blender, go. Yeah, I also probably didn't use that beauty blender right and I'm probably gonna get people mad at me about it, but whatever. Then concealer, we we'll just go over those exact spots. Like that. If I needed to, I'll add like more in as I do it. Just use my little brush. So like this would only be like a late start type of a day. Like this would never be like a school day. Wow, look, you can already see the difference just with like the concealer. That's kind of funny. Just kind of Go like that, rub the excess kind of wherever. Um, then honestly, I, I'm kind of like making it up as I go right now. Cause I had to wake up at 5 a.m. for school all of senior year, which sucked. And I would have to go to school to get my ex-best friend or she would get me, like, we switched. Then we would go to GVC, and then we would go back to school. I have a vlog about it. You can go watch that. Um, but, yeah, that was, like, my morning routine for school, and it sucked, and I basically rolled out of bed every single day because I could barely open my eyes. And usually I fell asleep while driving, which is not safe at all. Um, but for eyeshadow, I really wouldn't... I've probably put any on. I have my bronzer right here that I probably would just kind of grab some and just go like this to give my eyes some definition again since I took it away with the concealer. Probably just like that though. Maybe a little underneath. Like that. Very natural looking. Um, if I wanted to, probably a little bit on the side of my nose right there. Even though I don't really contour my nose because I don't really need to. I kind of have like, in my opinion, I like my nose, so I don't really try and fix it. But I'm not gonna say like what type of nose I have because I'm probably wrong and gonna get hate for it. So um, then for highlighter, because clearly she's been something I'd be doing for a while. <laughs> um, I just have my Anastasia, you've seen her before literally do her all the time um and since i don't have contour on i'll probably pick the darker shade to kind of like you know help with the look i guess i don't know can you tell like i don't really know what i'm doing like i pretend that i'm good at makeup but i don't think i am oh and then for these two i pick the white one and then i'll get a little bit more go right there Ooh, took a little much, but to be fair, the one above my lip probably will fade away within like 0.2 seconds of me doing anything else in the day. Like if I got a sip of water or took a really deep breath of air or something, she usually uh, fades away pretty quickly. So now that I'm done with like that mascara, I would probably use Better Than Sex 
mascara, not gonna lie, but my current favorite mascara is Superhero. Um, it comes in a box like this. It's this is my new one that I just haven't opened from Christmas. My grandma actually randomly bought like a ton of these and handed them out to everybody. And they work wonders. So like this is better than six. I'm just gonna do the same thing real quick. I'm gonna curl them and put it on. Okay, this is with one coat. Do you see the difference? You see why I'm in love with this mascara? Like remind you, this was like two coats and this is one. Um, and then I would use better than sex on my lower ones. But the problem with this is that this does not come off of my eyelashes for like days. So like, I'm gonna have to put this on the other one. Cause otherwise it's gonna look a little weird. But yes, that, where did I go? Okay, my goodness, my brain just had a huge brain fart. Okay. Okay guys, so that was my freshman year of high school makeup versus my senior year of high school makeup very different but at the same time not like my cheeks look different my nose looks the same um honestly my eyebrows don't look the same because my eyebrows just don't look the same but my eyebrows are the same um and then eyeshadow a little bit different you know and mascara oh, love her but yeah, I will do like another quick little close-up video of like the makeup that'll go after this or right here. And yeah, that is this video. I will see you all next week. I have a special video plan. Just I was going to do it this week, but we ran out of timing for it. So it's going to be next week's or hopefully, well, hopefully next week's. If it's not, it'll be the week after that. But yeah. Okay. Love you all. See you next week. Bye.